Hey guys, what's going on? It's that home theater dude. We're out here at the Asylum about to do a new unboxing for you guys. We have the Kaleidoscape, we have the Strato C, as well as their brand new Terra 22TB uh, movie server. So we're gonna be doing an unboxing and an overview. We're gonna do it right after the intro. All right, guys, so let's go ahead and get this stuff out of the box. What I noticed whenever I was doing, um, you know, my deep dive on Kaleidoscape, I know the product, I know it very well. Um, you know, the problem is, is that whenever they swapped over to the separates, right? Um, I haven't been able to find a good unboxing video to tell you exactly what's in there. Cause what I'm trying to figure out is, as you guys see behind us, we have a bunch of classic cars and hot rods. So I'm trying to hot rod the, the Clyde Escape. I had the Audio Quest guy come over and basically let me know about the differences in between, you know, cabling and using different stuff like that. So um, what I noticed is that on the, the outgoing model, the Strato S, there was only one power plug that you needed, right? So obviously it's gonna save you money if you wanna upgrade your power cables. This one has two. Um, so spoiler alert, that's kind of the reason why I want to do the unboxing. So in the actual case itself, you have your Strato C. This is the movie player for you guys. And I love the packaging that this thing, this thing comes in. It's nice. They really take pride in it. So you get your case scape right there on the front. Obviously this is mine, so I can rip, off, rip this off if I'd like but I'm gonna be transporting this. So I'll leave it on for now. In the back, as you will see, let's see if we can get that thing focused. We have your 12 volt DC right here. It's gonna come with a brick, with the, you know, the, the, the dongle with the brick attached to it. And then you plug your power cable into that. You have your video output. You also have your digital output and audio output. So if you guys are using this thing for like a trend off, it makes sense to, it makes sense to use both of these um, outputs, cause it's gonna make you sync a lot quicker. And you know, if you're just using a standard Denon or something like that, video is just good enough. Uh, you have the USB right here, network, hardwire this unit in, IR extender, and then we have a service port right there. So that's kind of it for this unit itself. What else you get in the package? So in there you get a 1.5 meter HDMI ready to go for you. You also get your power cable. You know, if you wanna upgrade that one, you can. You have the brick that I was talking about that basically plugs into the back of this unit. This has, this plugs in the back of your unit. This plugs into this one right here, obviously. And then you have a hardwired connection right here. This looks like a pretty beefy Cat5 cable. So nice terminations on that one. So that kind of concludes this unit right here. So I'm gonna, box this back up and I'll check back in whenever I do the unboxing of the 12 TB. All right, so let's check out what we got in the box over here. So this is the brand new 22 terabyte Kaleidoscape. So let me pop this thing out. Actually, I'm gonna set this aside for a second. I will show you guys what is in this box. One, two, three. So you get the same thing as before. You get your power brick, right? So this is this actually has a different adapter to it. So you will notice that you can't mess these up. This one has its own proprietary plug. That one goes into the back of the unit. I'll show you guys that in a second. And then this plugs into the back of that brick. And then again, you have your beefed up. Well, no, this one isn't beefed up. You have a uh, patch cable. All right, so this is the brand new 22 terabyte Terra movie server. I think hundreds of, of movies you can store on this bad boy. So it's, uh, it's pretty cool um, in its design, you know, very sleek. I really like the styling on it. You have the Kaleidoscape that lights up here in the front. You can peel this thing off as well. I will do that whenever I get back home. In the back, you will see, let me see if I can get off camera so that it'll focus on this one. You have your 12 volt DC, like I was talking about, that's the proprietary one that you're gonna plug into there. So this one requires, this system requires two power plugs um, and they are supplied, but you can upgrade them if you want. 
network right here, USB service, that's kind of it. This looks like a hard detent for, um, for uh, reset. So here's something to note. These are black right here. Let me see if I can get this in focus. We have one, two, three, right? So if you have the, the additional rack mount kit that comes with this unit, um, basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna pop out one, two, three of these little things, and then you're going to set this into the rack mount kit, and then you will put the screws back on it on the bottom, one, two, three, and then you're done. So then you have a nice, concise looking rack mount kit for your movie system. So uh, I'm gonna do that whenever I get home, but that's kind of gonna be the wrap up for this quick unboxing. Um, I will let you guys know, this is, this is gonna be pretty cool. So this will be an up, this will be an ongoing series, right? So what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be doing uh, more, movie, more movie updates um, monthly, and then we will show you guys the benefits of the Cloud Escape versus say like a traditional streaming device or like an actual Blu-ray player. Um, audio is not gonna be very well it's, it's going to be subjective, you know, so it's not going to come through over the internet, but probably we'll be able to do A-B test in the video to show you guys the benefits of this thing. Um, I, I fully believe in it, but, you know, that, that, that is just my opinion right now. So what I'm trying to do is just educate you guys. So if you guys want to buy these things, you, you can. Uh, so uh, reach out to your local Kaleidoscape dealer. Link's down in the description. You guys can check these things out. If you guys like video content like this, if you guys want to see more videos from the asylum, let me know down in the comments. Like, share, and subscribe. See you next time.